Previously in the anime, humanity was invaded by different races such as demons, angels, beastmen, spirits, and so on. But the hero Sid defeated the ruler of four races one by one and humanity won the Great War. But suddenly our protagonist Kai got sucked into a black hole. Which took him to an alternate world where humanity lost and became slaves of those four races, in this world no one knows about him. So Kai goes to a place where demons were sealed and there he found Sid's light sword. Then Kai was suddenly sucked into a different world where he saved a girl named Rin whose race is a mystery. So Kai brought her back to the human settlement and talked with his friend Jean, she was pretending to be a boy and Kai gave her the names of her parents and told her he knows she's a girl. Which made her believe in Kai a little bit, so they all planned to use Kai's knowledge of demons to defeat the ruler of demons, Vanessa. Now, as the story continues, Rin had kept it hidden from Kai that she's an experiment created from DNA of all races, demons, humans, spirits, angels, and such, so she hated herself and other races. But for her, Kai was different because he never treated her indifferently and accepted her, so now all the units rolls out to fight the demon queen Vanessa. But Saki was having a nervous breakdown because it's the fight against the strongest demon, and Kai included her as well. But Kai trusts only Saki and Ashran to have his back because they were his friends, and Rin assured her she's also strong, but she's unsure she could beat Vanessa. So Rin thought of self-exploding to take down Vanessa with herself, but then again, even a calm dude such as Ashran was scared from this mission. And now the time comes and Jean gave a final speech to her unit to raise the moral of her soldiers because they are about to step into the demon stronghold, with it. They barged into the stronghold and encountered the demons, but Kai took the front line to make way for others, but many more demons came out later. So Kai used a thunder bullet to burn them all to crypts, it was a bullet Kai brought from his world that was made by powers of other races. And now Vanessa is on the top floor and Kai was going after her, so Jean ordered her unit to stop any demons coming from outside to enter the building, and with that the infiltration begins. But there an imp summoned a giant demon to hold them back, and Fallon engages the demon to let others move out. Then they fred the human captives and went to another floor where Jean was hit by thunder magic but nothing happened to her because she had an elven garment on. Which has the power to nullify magic, so she told Kai and Rin to move forward and leave the demons to her and her soldiers. Then Rin made a tag for everyone that could hide their presence so they could smoothly move out, then Ashran and Saki stayed behind in the control room to turn off the light when Kai signals him. But then security alarms started to buzz out as a demon had the knowledge to operate human tech thanks to Vanessa, but the demon saw Rin and thought of her as ugly being. But there were too many demons here, so Rin made an ice barrier and stays behind to take care of these demons. They could tell from smell Rin was made from DNA of many different races but right now she only wants to stay with Kai and that's all. As for Kai, he saw the demon queen was a pretty succubus. And there the scene shifts back to Jean as she was struggling to fight the demon, but her armor was coming handy and her sword transformed into a bow with which she took the demon out. But the armor chips away the wearer's life, yet Jean was throwing away her life knowingly in order to defeat the demons, but then another one came out and fell and jumped in to take over from here. As for Kai, he was now face to face with Vanessa and she found him amusing and thought of making Kai a slave, but first she asked about the person with the elven garment. She thought Kai was the one wearing it but Kai revealed he's not, he also tells her that he's from a world where demons were defeated, and the one who defeated her was a human. She found it as an absurd joke because the humans were the weakest, and Kai told her that prophets had killed her, that name rings a bell in Vanessa's mind. And she started to recall something or many things about Sid, but she snapped back and wants to wrap things up, but Kai counters her attack, and it turns out to be an illusion. And from here on out the fight begins, then she casted a wide-scale fire spell that shook the entire building up, but Kai avoided death, which surprised our demon queen. It was all thanks to Sid's sword and their Rin also came in after cleaning up but she was injured, yet she wants to help Kai in the fight. But the thing that attacked Rin where she was sealed off came to attack Vanessa as well. Vanessa recognized she's last riser and riser begins to erase Vanessa. So she releases her limiter to go all out because riser was the puppet of Alfreya, leader of the angels, her powers were an overkill but riser survived that attack head on and left. Their Rin got terrified because Vanessa from their world wasn't this powerful. Yet, Rin tried a suicide attack to let Kai retreat, but her barrier got broken too easily, and in order to save her, Kai tried to attack Vanessa and lost, he was bleeding a lot. 
And Rin thought Vanessa killed Kai, Vanessa also thought the same but now, Rin lost herself and started to release her real powers to kill Vanessa anyhow. Her body transformed into a mixture of all races, and now she got on par with Vanessa at least, she wants to kill Vanessa brutally for killing Kai, but still, Vanessa is the demon queen, and her powers were immense, so Vanessa then told Rin that she could have saved Kai if she would have used this power earlier, but she didn't because she was afraid that Kai would hate this form, and as a result Kai died and this death is on her hands, but nothing matters to Rin anymore since Kai died, she wants to die as well, and used a curse to kill Vanessa along with her. But the curse was stopped because Rin lost all of her magical powers, this is Vanessa's stronghold so naturally she made many magic circles to be prepared for the invasion from all the races. And now Rin was devastated, and Vanessa was ready to kill her and attacked her, but Kai jumped in and swapped Rin away from the danger, he was fallen for a while but then again, he has the power of Sid's sword, Vanessa didn't know about this, and Kai was now ready for a round 2. But Vanessa got pissed that bugs such as humans were fighting this war where they can't hope to win because they are weak. And she knows what all the cliché humans thinks often Vanessa was well aware, all the humans thinks that they will show the power of humans, potential of humans, and the future humans holds. But it's nothing but a sandcastle that would fall apart any time, she won't acknowledge humans because there are many powerful beings outside and she acknowledges them as heroes of other races. But Kai doesn't want to be a hero. He's here to show the spirit of humans that never breaks apart and makes them overcome all hardship, and he's here as a representative of humans, then the chit chat got over and Vanessa attacks again, but Kai cuts through it, then there Kai signals for lights out, and Vanessa got into the dark because she saw that Kai knew she can't sense humans because they don't have magic. But she saw his sword and attacked it, but it was a wrong call, Kai was right behind her in 10 years of training, all of it paid off and Kai got her in the end. But then Vanessa started to recall everything about Sid, Sid had told her once that someone would cause the world reincarnation to alter the world, and told her to find that being. So the best guess is that one of the heroes of the other three races could be behind this, and Sid saw this and asked Vanessa to protect her sword to prepare for this occurrence. Record says Vanessa and Sid were enemies, but there are many things hidden away from records, like a forbidden code that they don't know about, but then again. Vanessa was frustrated she lost to Kai, so she told him to be prepared because if they met again, she would definitely use her charm to make him fall for her. And with that, the Demon Queen was defeated, and the humans were fred from this region, but now Kai has to find the answer to the things Vanessa told her to do to make their world normal again. And their Jean came in to congratulate them on their victory over the Demon Queen, but now that this is over, Jean saw hope for humanity and wants to free them all from all the other races. The land is divided into three major lands, one that rules celestial, another one that is ruled by spirits, and the third that is ruled by mythical beasts. There's a rebel group on every region and Jean wants to work with them to free the humans from their tyranny, so she invited Rin and Kai to join her in this quest and fight alongside her. But Kai was already planning for the same thing, so Jean prepared her unit and whoever wanted to join them for this fight, and Kai made up his mind to save this world on behalf of Sid. And right there, our two episodes ends right here, so stay tuned to watch more of the upcoming episode, and to watch that. Subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon to never miss out on any of our updates, until then, take care.